Well, everybody, welcome to Dak Man Productions and welcome to Brady's Train Outlet right here. So, what brings me out today to Brady's Train Outlet, which is five hours away from South Jersey, by the way? Well, a couple of fans of the Dak Man Productions channel told me that Brady's made a special run of the Lionel Conrail SD45 locomotives. So I drove all the way out here just to check that out and maybe check the store out too. We'll go inside now. Before we head on in, here's uh, Brady's Trains Outlet. You can see a better video of it right here. So yes, we are here in person. Waiting for opening on this wonderful sunny day. There you go. Brady's Trains Outlet. Waiting to get in. Okay, we'll uh, check it out here. Alright, so we walked through the door of Brady's Trains. But I'm just blown away already. <laughs> it's like, wow. So we're going to take a walk around the store. And uh, first thing we're going to do is... Uh, if you like Polar Express, well, we'll look back here. But first, we'll look at this layout here. That's cool. Here we go, Polar Express. For those who like Polar Express. Panning around. The store is amazing. I actually have one of these. That's, that's sort of different. And all these trains you're seeing are for sale, by the way. <laughs> so I'm just taking it all in. Mm. <laughs> I like that. Rude Runner. Oh, I loved that cartoon when I was a kid. <laughs> Got some Angela Trotter Thomas cars. I've never seen those uh, Lionel Shell Oil. It's in a, a special box, it looks like. Pretty neat. Chevy service station. So it looks like you got a complete collection if you wanted it here. Shell service station, a box car, a storage tank, and a tank car. Same thing with the uh, John Deere. You have a general store and some rolling stock. Looking at the one layout here. So cool. Well, there's more to see. Let's go this way. Oh, yeah. Sixty-six mil gondolas. Mm -hmm. 
so neat. Looking for Thomas. He's got that too. Well, let's look into the MTH section. That I think is pretty much what you call it. Oh boy. All right, so we'll pan down this way, and uh, this is all MTH. So I know you're going to ask questions. Is this Rail King or Premier? So you can actually look at the stock number. Anything that starts with 3-0 dash, that's a Rail King. So this shelf is all Rail King. Or this wall, I should say. As far as the locomotives. Got some cool stuff. And once again, if you see anything you like, it's called Brady's Trains. <clears throat> Lots of cool stuff here. Look what we got here, display case. If you're looking for, uh, actually the display case is 150, but that's for the engine. Coors or Carling Brewing. Oh, it's black label. And got some rolling stock. Oh, you even got some more Premier stuff down here. So we're getting into the Premier stuff. Tank curves. No, I'm not going to move the boxes around because that creates uh, shelf wear and it makes it hard to sell. But you can see what it is without me having to move stuff around. Okay, now we have the Premier locomotive, so we'll take a look at that. And don't worry, we'll get close-ups here for you guys. Alright, so let's start off with the steam here. Again, this is all MTH Premier because it starts out with the stock number 20 dash. Uh, well, the exception of this one here, that's a that's a Rail King. And we have a Premier Big Boy. Isn't there people looking for a Premier Big Boy? Why is this still here? <laughs> and it's a good price. So. Very nice. And we have another Big Boy, 4014. 1650 looks like it's got a gloss real high gloss finish on it really cool so this is the oil burner version and the other one is what let's check out the other one here and the other one it just says number 4014 so i'm not sure what version that is 
But yeah, he's got two big boys here. Somebody should be calling him up and buying these. Pen Railroad. Good though. Wow. Yeah. I'm going to ask him. This address he gave you is different than what we sent his other packages to. Who? Who's Chris Check out this Metrolink. Wow. Monica Helia. Oh, Very that's nice. That's a plain one. Do you, want, do you know what my favorite thing in you? There we go. That one. Now check out our Eve. In case anybody's looking for something. Very nice. So this is just the MTH section. <laughs> wow. We have more trains here. We'll take a little quick look through what's here. I'm pretty sure everything that's being sold out here is brand new, so they'll have boxes. Oh, yeah. Conrail. Two Conrail caboose's. Very nice. There you go. Conrail Everstamp Penn Central. And that is priced at $65. Yep, $65. I've seen somebody trying to sell them for 100 bucks on eBay. Alright, so we'll head this way. So it looks like we have some military stuff here. Wow. Okay. Let's see what we got down here. All crane and crane tenders sold as sets. Well, it makes sense. Why would you buy a crane without the tender? Mm. Well, there is more yet. So got all this, all that. This is a really cool store. What we got? MTH. I was just looking to see. Wow. I don't think I've ever seen this. A Chrome Norfolk Southern Hopper Car. 
and it's chrome too. Got a very shiny finish. See the reflection on my finger? <clears throat> Never seen one of them before. GATX Glycerine Liquid. Is that a is that a premiere piece? No, nah, it's Royal King. Just wondering. Wow. Star Trek. Very nice. Real King Harley Davidson, if you're looking for that stuff. Area 51. So we'll pan around here. Try to get some include pricing for those who are looking for sets. BNSF. <sighs> Very nice. <laughs> Celebration cars. And then got some more stuff yet. Looks like we uh, got some more service cars, uh, Navy, Marines, Air Force. Brady's does have a website, so make sure you check out the website. Oh, wow, that's cool. Atlantic Coastline. Norfolk Southern Work Train. There you go. Oh, she got thrown out of the hot. Seven hundred dollars. Yeah, she heard me. I got her on the speaker. What the? Uh, hey, uh, my stepson's coming in from uh, Florida tonight. The airport like drove around five thirty, and I'm gonna meet him with my car. Check out some stuff below. Starter sets. Another Conrad Caboose. I don't know if I got that one. Northeast Caboose. Operating couplers. Limited. This one doesn't have smoke. Wow. 
Got some lion scale over here. Lion scale is the old weaver molds. More lion scale down here. Looks like there's a conrail and a lion scale. Okay, so the price right, let's check out this stuff. Cheap. Okay. Okay, you give them the number of the no. rack? Very nice. Okay, good. It's physically at the warehouse. So <laughs> check out this wall. This is where the wow factor comes in. <laughs> oh my. Definitely wow factor. So let's check out. Well, we'll, we'll do a back shot here. Then we'll look at everything closer. Hey, that operation, remember? Yeah, worked out perfect. Yeah, worked out good. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> So you have, looks like the Santa Fe is selling. Wow. Yeah, I had a guy come in the other day from Baltimore. Uh-huh. And uh, he said, well, you got the Santa Fe is selling. We were talking there, talking about it. But I said, well, if you want it, I'll give it to you for 3000 It comes with the add-on cars, too. So he's looking at everything here, blah, blah, blah. Next thing you know, he says, okay, I'll take one. He says, but I want this one. <laughs> he wants the regular solo. Yeah, right. So I don't know. But I'm just as glad because I only had one or two of those left. But I had three or four of those. So it worked out pretty good. Yeah. And then there's a Polar Express or so. Yeah, the Polars are very hard to find. Very nice. Evie Lackawanna. Let's see what we can do with that one. There's a price on that set. There you go. CP post war celebration. Which one? Post war celebration. Texas special. Is that on the warehouse? The new BNSF coal train. I thought I seen it in the warehouse. Yeah, see what the. Do you know the number? Yeah, I don't know about that, Annie. Here I find out. Uh, New York Central. Yeah. So, I don't need that. And here underneath the... the Get some pricing for you guys. There you go. Why not have a brand new line out? Oh, okay. P, uh, P and L E. Big one. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. So, I'm good there. In good shape. So, I was wondering if you had a CP. Okay, I'll look. She'll look here. Okay. Well, these are the sets that you're seeing pictures of, or video of, that is. Got CSX here. Reading Northern. For those of you who are looking for Reading Northern hopper cars. How you doing there today? Check this out. Lion Vision Line. As long as you don't take all my money. <laughs> That's what we're here for. Because you know what? When I get your money, all I do is just write the checks out. So, here you have Lion Vision Line stock cars. Oh, from, uh, yeah, would you buy a chance to do Bob's phone number? Yeah. Because oh, yeah. you were talking about doing a train show at New York, but I never heard no more about it. We're, yeah, we all three of us have, have or share a booth. No, you would be like a flea market there at the. Oh, yeah, in the beginning? Yeah, because yeah. I think I canceled, huh? I don't know. Yeah, you look familiar. I think, I think I may have met you at New York. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm, I'm in the blue hole. Okay. Yeah, let me see here. Did you come over and speak with us? Oh, yeah. Uh, well, I'm just 
<laughs> That's probably where I, I, I saw you. Okay. This is just insane. No, I'm Jay Bird. Stuff okay. they have here. Yeah. I, I always call Bob the Turkey Man. Okay, great. How do you recognize? Right. What were you doing? You were working on a truck the other day. I haw asphalt. Oh, do you? Yeah. What, was, what time you working? All right, so here we are. Ray Jones. He's uh, oh, okay. The line out stuff. <laughs> okay, we'll go get line out legacy. Yeah. So we'll take a look at all that stuff. And we have the Baldwin demonstrators, it looks like. Monica Hill, yeah. I guess I'm saying that right. <laughs> That's a hard word to say. Great Northern. Wow. Check out that Union Pacific. It sort of matches the uh, Hot Dog Challenger. Atlantic Coastline, Rock Island, Union yeah, Pacific Genset. I don't know. He remembered seeing them. Um, he remembered seeing them um, up there. E, G, and E. I haven't. Wow. Uh, I mean, I, uh, here, 39103. Pennsylvania Sharks. Check out that Union Pacific. Crazy. So that's what they call the post-war celebration. P L and E. Um, so he's looking for some kind of setup oh, yeah. that would have the theme in these. If it's there, I don't have the numbers on. I've never seen that pill bear of rail before. I don't know, that's the 60. Penn Central right, Switcher. Ohio Central Systems. Electric Motive Demonstrator. Yeah. Then I have a. Wow. That's for him with the great for the on it? I've never seen that before. Customized weathering and graffiti. Strasburg. They got a Strasburg yeah, switcher. Yeah, I have the problem is I, I don't know the um, Number, and I don't have everything. Penn Central S2 Electric. And you have display case of cars. Hopefully there's too, not too much yeah. of a glare. Five minutes, huh? Five minutes is all it takes. You have to ID. getting it. All right, now we get into the Lionel Steam locomotives. <laughs> oh my. And I know there are fans of steam locomotives, so. They're like, they were like 400 some dollars at one time. They made so many different cars. They got a five car set. Wow. They should be brand new. That's crazy. T1 duplex. Oh, that would be nice. Yeah. yeah it's, yes. 
Yeah, it's almost the same color. Yeah, exactly. Yes, that pulled the green. That went on every railroad. It, it's it, it's the same one. Yeah. Was that number? Did you say that number was up in the warehouse? No, I don't know what the number is. All I can tell you is I have all the numbers. Do you know what See the if we can get closer is? to the I top there. The Oops, too close. Yeah, there we go. Thirty-nine one hundred six and thirty-nine one hundred fifty-one are sets of passenger cars, Cubs for celebration. Huh, yeah. Man. Yeah. Well, I need the number of the thing. So, what is the main reason for my visit besides doing a store tour? Well. There were a couple fans who told me, messaged me, asking me if I knew that Brady's made a custom run Conrail SD45 with Lionel. And I said, no, I didn't. <laughs> and here it is. is custom run with Super Bass. And I didn't want to miss out on this. I think he said there's only 40 of those sets that were made. I have uh, people who are into standard gauge, so here you go. Standard gauge set. So this is the Brown State engine and four cars. So yes, these are for sale. Three car standard 309 series passenger set. Some more template. Oh, look at that line out trains one. That's cool. I like that. And TH Caboose. Is that an actual switch? It looks like it's a real switch tower. Huh. T1. What road name is T1? See something you like? Make sure you mention you've seen it on Dakman Productions video on YouTube. Check out that boat. That's cool. There are those who love bargain bins. So yeah, Brady's has bargain bins you can pick through. Let's come out and visit. Got a $10 bin. $5 bin, another $10 bin. Then you got a bargain bin with uh, stuff still in boxes. Looks like a lot of MPC stuff. Huh. There you go, Penn Central. So you never know. Why no? Huh. So here's your bargain bin. Fifteen bucks. Ah, oh, look what I found in the bargain bin. Conroe. But this is not scale, so we're putting it back. <laughs> All right, so Brady's has scenery, too. <laughs> wow. And we'll look at some of this stuff. So he's got the Woodland Scenics. Rail King. Lots 
of scenery. That's Menards. So we'll get into the Menards here in a minute. Couple line out scenery. All right. So we're going to get into. Uh, wow. Some Menards here. So yeah, Brady's has Menards. I did not know that. Uh, here goes that Ford dealership again. Do I have to say I don't like Fords again? <laughs> uh, Taco Bell with a car with working brake lights. That is so cool. That's a cool building, FedEx building. Amtrak. Oh. <laughs> M&M's one. Uh, M&M's UFO one. That's cool. I like that. That's hilarious. <laughs> it's whimsical stuff that Johnny, here, that uh, makes a difference sometimes. So here you have the police plaza. Now I noticed, at first I thought it said country suites, but I noticed it says county suites. So I'm not sure if that's to get it out of uh, trademark of saying country suites because I actually stayed in country suites uh, hotel before. I like this Schneider building. Schneider truck building. That's cool. I'm just all over the place. So yeah, he's got a ton of scenery. Pan around here. So you can see they got the Woodland Scenics uh, turf and stuff like that. Take a look back here. Fun in action. Looks like a bridge, girder bridge maybe. Got a selection of fast track. So he's got a big selection of custom Supreme Atlas O switches. Some Atlas track. Guard graves. Yeah, now we're talking. The stuff I like to use, guard graves. 
Check out the fast track truss bridges. Sorry if the camera's getting shaky. I'm holding it high just to catch the video of the fast track and bulk. Oh, looks like he's got some flats here for sale. <laughs> Area 51 Alien Center. <laughs> this is so funny. There's even a flat of Brady's train outlet. Here, go ahead. I will, thanks. You're welcome. Take a look at some of this stuff here. Got some Halloween, Disney. Happy Halloween. They usually like Halloween stuff. Pac-Man hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I met him up in New Jersey. Right, right. He took the video of you. Yep. I know he's famous. I feel bad for charging double now. <laughs> 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 you know, I just find nothing back right, right. Hey, do you have another? Do you have any more of the CS6 uh, Legacy uh, sure. AC6000s? Oh, let me take a look. Uh, I've got the one on there. Okay, as you can see, both boxes say Brady's Trains Exclusive Conrail. This one's the Super Base. And this one's the Legacy Powered Unit. So, according to uh, Mr. Brady, he only had 40 sets made. Another interesting thing is I met fans of the channel while I was at the store. One of them was a Conroe guy. He seen what I was buying. I told him why, and he actually bought a set too. All right, so I had a good time at Brady's Train Outlet here in Pennsylvania. And uh, so I'm gonna head home and uh, we'll do a review of those Conrail SD45 uh, custom run sets that are custom run for Brady's in a different video. But now it's time for the DAC man to get home, drive another four and a half hours home to South Jersey and get some sleep. And we'll do a review on those um, two uh, Rhino SD45 Conrail locomotive units. So can't wait. So we'll see you guys uh, trackside. Goodbye.